this video, I'm going to show you how to unprotect a Word document that has been restricted in terms of editing. You may have received a Word document, which is a form that you need to complete only to find out that you are restricted to the areas that you can actually type on the document and you're not permitted to modify anything on the document. All you can really do is just type in the fields that are provided to you. So if I wanted to go ahead and increase the space over here, the form won't allow me to. And that's because whoever created the form placed a password on this document preventing you or restricting you from editing this form. In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove that password protection in 10 easy steps. So right here, we've got a document that is password protected. And I can tell this because if you look at the top menu panel, everything is in gray. So you're not really allowed to do anything. If you click on developer at the top menu panel and then click on restrict editing, you'll notice that this document is password protected. If you click on stop protection, you're going to need a password in order to be able to unlock this document. I don't have the password for this document. So the only way that I'm able to go ahead and modify this document is to basically remove the password. And here's how to do that. The first thing that you want to do is save this file as an RTF document. So the first thing that you want to do is save this file as an RTF document. So click on file, save as, and I'm going to change the file name to include RTF at the end, just so that I can distinguish it from the other files that I have on my desktop. And I'm going to save the file as a RTF, a rich text format file. Click save. Great. So we can go ahead and close this original document. Now I've got two documents on my desktop, the one that is protected and then one that is protected but is in a rich text format. I don't need the original one. I'm going to go ahead and delete that. Next thing that you need to do is you need to open the RTF file in Notepad. So go ahead and open Notepad and then drag your RTF file and drop it into Notepad. What this is going to do is it's going to basically open the code to the actual document that you're looking at. Now this looks like a lot of gibberish to you, but it doesn't matter. You don't need to understand any part of what's in front of you. Here's what you do need to know. You need to be able to remove the password and to do that, click on edit, find, or just press control F and then type password. You'll notice that it located the word password in this document. What you want to do is you want to highlight everything after the word password hash and delete it. So up until the bracket right there, delete. And that's it. Now you want to go ahead and save the file and close notepad. Now open the protected RTF file one more time. The RTF file is still protected. So if you look at the top menu panel, everything is still grayed out. So what we need to do is to stop the protection. Click on developer click on restrict editing, go to the bottom of the page and on the right corner, click on stop protection. This time it did not prompt me for a password. It just simply basically gave me the options to restrict editing and to modify it. Go ahead and uncheck both of these boxes. I've completely removed the password protection from this document. I'm going to go ahead and close this. And now what you want to do is click on file save as, and now I'm going to save this document back as a Word document. So I'm going to change the file name to unprotected and change the file type to Word document. I'm going to save this back to my desktop and that's it. I'm going to close the RTF file and get rid of it. I don't need it anymore. If you click on the unprotected file, you will notice that the menu is now open to you. You can modify and change this as much as you want to without any restriction. If you did find this video useful, please subscribe to our channel.